Morning guys. So I've not long got back from my run and it was like a sh really short run. So I've just like started a new training program which my dad has written me of which I've like talked about with somebody who's recently just run the London Marathon as well. Um, and we come to the conclusion that like, you know, if I am run the, running the London Marathon, I do get in, I've got 11 months to train. And I should be doing, rather than just long run, long run, long run, long run, because then I'm only training the slow twitch fibres of my muscles. I should be doing some speed training and some fat alert training as well. So this morning I went out with the aim to <coughs> run up to a certain point that would bring me to about one and a half miles. So I jogged out and then I was supposed to run back as fast as I could non-stop. So I was running as fast as I could on the way back and I just had to like break into a walk at some point and then I'd go right I'll walk to that driveway and then I'll run as fast as I can again and then <clears throat> I had to stop again. By stop I mean like break into a walk. Um, so then that kind of made it like fartlek training rather than speed training. So I've taken it as a fartlek training but I just feel like I've, I was sweating buckets when I got home and I felt knackered, I felt like I couldn't do any more. I jumped in the shower, got dressed, and now I feel like I haven't done anything. I don't feel like I've achieved anything. And I knew that this would happen. I was explaining this to Simon last night. I was just like, when I do the shorter distances, I feel like I'm failing. I feel like I'm not achieving anything. Like I'm sitting here now with loads of time to kill until I pick Holly up. Of course, I'm going to do some cleaning or whatever. But I don't feel like I've achieved anything big. Whereas when I'm doing the long runs after long runs, I feel like I'm coming home and I'm like, ooh, I can feel that. And to me, that's like a good sensation. It's almost like, it's almost like a form of punishment in a way. But like when you feel the burn, that's when I feel like I've <clears throat> achieved something. So I don't feel like I've achieved anything this morning at all. So I might ring my dad and be like, you know, what's the crack? I don't get it. I don't understand what this is about at all. But um, yeah, I feel quite disappointed, but there we are, it is what it is. So we'll just have to see how it goes. Maybe I'm just one of these slow plodders, long distances. Like I'm, I'm not fussed about getting faster really, but if I did want to get faster, then the training that I just did is necessary. I don't know, I don't know what to say really or do. So it'd be interesting if there are any other people out there who have this sort of issue, I don't know, not sure. Anyway, I'm going to go and do some cleaning now that I've got all this free time on my hands. I'll catch up with you later.
guys so i was on the phone to my friend for an hour which is like how this happens i was doing my face while i was speaking to her and i only managed to hoover my bedroom holly's bedroom and the living room i wanted to hoover the kitchen because that's like oh, the worst but i'll wait till holly gets picked up this evening and then i'll do the hallway the bathroom and the kitchen and before i go to bed i'll like clean the kitchen floor and stuff like that so while I've been cleaning, obviously I've had to move stuff around. I've got my big bag of empties. So this is now turning into like a two month bag of empties here. So let me know because for some reason the sound actually seems to be behaving on my camera at the moment. Ish. It's not bad. And I am getting my headphones tomorrow or today in the post. Fingers crossed. Let me know if you would like to see my empties vlog style entry rather than me sitting down and doing like a formal video um because i i do like going through my empties i like watching empties videos and stuff like that um and i do i'm itching to get it filmed but I'm, I'm just not sure about the whole formal video thing anymore is it really me is it worth it i don't know i like it so i think i will continue to do some but this is becoming obscene so if you'd like to see that vlog entry styly then let me know in the comments down below and i shall do that for you um but as for the now i'm going to quickly down my cup of tea i've got like seven minutes to do that i can do that and then go and pick up the doll face and then the world's our oyster for the afternoon the sun is semi shining through the semi cloud situation that we've got going on at the moment but yeah, all is good in the hood and I feel better for cleaning three rooms and I'll feel even better tonight by the time I've cleaned the rest of the house as well. So I might even go as far as bleaching the bathroom. Top dollar stuff. Anyway, I'll see y'all on the flip side. Bye. Hey guys. So I got my new headphones today. They came in the post. And if you didn't tell me that they weren't Apple, then I would have assumed that they were. So they came in a little box like this and they are identical to the Apple ones. So you could have fooled me. £1.25, who knew? I genuinely thought that I would be paying near on £10 for a new pair of headphones. But I've just inserted the jack into the place where it's supposed to go and it's made a funny noise so I'm not convinced that it was a case of getting new headphones it might be a case of well you can see this one is bent uh, whoops but it might be a case of the inside um, the plug needing cleaning so how would I go about cleaning that I do not know um, tweezers I don't have no idea but i won't know until i watch this little clip back if this has worked so fingers crossed that it has evening gang so i'm coming to you with a closing entry shock of flipping horror um my face is red because i just cleaned it god look at the sun shining there looks like some halo of light how peculiar um, yeah, and I just put a face oil on as well. They said to use one or two drops, but that didn't spread very far. And then I used four drops, and then that still didn't spread far enough. And then I just like just kept adding it and adding it, and my skin seems to be like just drinking it up. But now it actually does look really oily. So, whoops. Um, yes, what I actually wanted to come and talk to you about as my closing entry was Linkin Park's new album, which is out right now my um itunes sent me a little notification saying the rest of lincoln park's new album is now available to download of which i did which i've listened to it about three times already it's 10 songs long short and that's only 35 minutes long which i think is super short so i've had it on repeat it's bloody brilliant um the second to last song on there which is called it's the same, the name of the song is the same name as the album, which I will leave down here because I can't remember it. 
like one last light or shine a light or and anyway it's a really beautiful song and for those of you who know well no and because i don't want to keep banging on about it but if you go and listen to that one song if that can be your homework <laughs> for this evening or whenever you watch this listen to the lyrics of that you will see why i think that that song fits in and is basically written especially for me because me and lincoln park are like that we've been like that for 17 years They've been lyrically saving my life for 17 years now. That is the longest musical relationship that I've ever had with anyone, ever. So, thank you, Lincoln Park. And good night, everybody. See you all tomorrow. Bye.